being the youngest of six, my parents also, you know, bless them, but they were kind of checked out. My dad worked second shift. My, my mom was overwhelmed. I went and I did adventures. I would, you know, go and th think about like, how do I build a raft or how do I do this? And I would always be thinking of things. And I would go down to like the gas stations and take empty milk jugs because I realized they could float. And then I would put it on like driftwood and I, I built a ramp, I mean, not a ramp, a raft. And I would, and I was like, wow, this thing floats with all these empty milk jugs underneath. And I made an oar and like, you know, I would do these weird things. And I'm talking about when I was like, like eight years old, like never did I ever say you can't do something. It was always like, how can I make this happen? <laughs> how can yeah. I figure this out? And I think that that has continued to be part of my personality and my identity. I never looked at my situation and say, poor me, poor me, poor me, look at this or that. I was just more like, well, what can I figure out and do? What am I gonna do with my time? You know, we didn't really have TV or other stuff. So I was always just adventure and creating and taking the world around me. And one time I irrigated a river system and made a like a waterfall and had this beautiful pond with like, like fish in it. And like, but it was just the weirdest crap I would do as a kid, but I was always out there from sunrise to sunset, building something, doing something.